Hello, Stevies! Today, we are on a mission. And it's gonna sound a little funny. But today, we are on a mission to get pulled over by the police. <laughs> So I know this may sound a little strange, but let me explain. My father has been in the Nebraska State Patrol since I was in second grade. I don't know how many years that is, it's, it's a bunch. And at the end of this month, he is going to retire. His tour of duty is coming to an end, as it were. But I have never been pulled over by him. So I got a kind of a an idea of an area of where he is and I am going to go see if I can do something stupid in front of him and get pulled over by him for the first time hopefully he thinks it's cool and uh, and he doesn't write me a ticket but if he does it might be worth it <laughs> you know what I mean so yeah so here we go. Let's go get pulled over by the police. Uh, on purpose. When you're on a mission to get pulled over by the police, you gotta get yourself in a certain state of mind. You know what I mean? You've gotta, you gotta think like a criminal. So you got to drive like 80 mile an hour everywhere you go. You have to get yourself ready. You got to get pumped up for that big moment. For when you see the cop, you can do something incredibly stupid and it will feel normal. I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting I need to be a criminal. I keep slowing down to the speed limit. You can't do that. You gotta think like the criminal. I mean, not in construction zones, so. You know, fines double. But we're not that much of a criminal. We're your petty thief. We're not like your, your bank robber or anything like that. Not today, red light on a one lane bridge. I'm a criminal. You knew I was coming, so you changed. Ain't gotta try to fool me. Mm -mm -mm. I was going no matter what. Look at this guy. He has no idea. He just pulled out in front of a criminal. Oh yeah! Criminal time! Woo! I'm crazy! I'm a law broker, buddy! This is what I do! This is what I do! This is some criminal stuff right here. Obeying the law. That's criminal. You know, I can't even say when it happened in my life that I became such a criminal. Now, the only thing that can throw a big old wrench into this plan of mine, there's a couple things. Number one, it's the wrong cop, right? It's somebody else, bad things happen. Number two, dad figures out it's me right away and then makes me like, lay down on the ground and handcuffs me and all that crap because he would think that kind of thing was funny i i would i wouldn't because i'm i'm not that kind of criminal you know what i mean i'm a i'm a six over criminal petty thief another bad thing that could happen is somebody who i'm um, I've uh, enlisted to help find, help me find him, tells him about what I'm doing, and then he has like a whole bunch of other cops there to like really mess with me. That would be like the uncoolest thing ever. <laughs> oh, that's him. That's him. That's him. 
I was doing 70. I was doing 70. Yes! <laughs> Lay down on the ground and handcuffs me and all that crap. Because he would think that kind of thing was funny. Oh, what if he's after the guy in front of me though? That's going to suck if he is. <laughs> now there's a bunch of things I could do here. I could run up and give him a hug. Or I could take off running. That'd be funny too, wouldn't it? Hey, you're not in uniform. Are you guys cops? Are you guys cops? They know we're not cops! So how does it feel to only have a couple days left? I don't know. It feels really... I think I like this job too much. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. I just got pulled over by my dad. <laughs> by the time this airs, he'll be long retired. Or he'll be retired. He's retiring this month. That's why I've always kept quiet about... Uh, him being a cop but i don't have to anymore because he, he ain't gonna be a cop at the end of this month but 35 years he'd been a nebraska state patrolman and that's his white all-wheel drive charger there the 2020 i think he said but that was fun never been pulled over by my dad before all right let's go home fun uh, he knew it was me though so thank you to all the law enforcement out there thank you to all the first responders for your service uh, present or retired thanks thanks for everything you guys do so if you like this video hit the like button if you want to see more stuff like this who knows maybe we'll find another cop and have him pull us over Hit the bell notification so you know when we load up next. And until next time, everybody stay cool. And we will see you on the road. This guy probably was thinking, that guy just got pulled over. And which is true. Which is true. My time of being a criminal is over.